Good morning. Thanks for starting your day with Denver 7 News. I'm Molly Hendrickson. And I'm Brian Sanders. Let's get right to our top stories. Mike Pence and Kamala Harris will take the stage in tonight's vice presidential debate. The coronavirus pandemic is expected to be a big topic of discussion. The Commission on Presidential Debates honored Harris's request for plexiglass dividers between the speakers after President Trump tested positive for the virus. Some other rules, anyone not wearing a mask will be escorted out and candidates will now be seated 12 feet apart. You can watch the debate right here on Denver 7 starting at 7 p.m. Two members of Colorado Congressman Doug Lamborn's staff have tested positive for the coronavirus. They are both based in Washington, D.C. According to our partners at the Denver Post, the deputy chief of staff tested positive over the weekend and Lamborn's military legislative assistant tested positive yesterday. An official who spoke anonymously to the Post says Lamborn is in Colorado attending fundraisers and is refusing to take a test himself. The Colorado Springs Republican did not respond to Denver 7's request for comment. RTD is looking at changes to more than two dozen bus and light rail routes. RTD's website shows some routes are being discontinued, while others will see an increase. There are virtual town hall meetings planned over the next week so people can ask questions. The first meeting is tonight. RTD is facing a $215 million budget shortfall next year. Now here's meteorologist Lisa Hidalgo with your Denver 7 forecast. On yet again, what's going to be another beautiful but warm day. Yesterday was gorgeous. This morning, you're going to find 40s and 50s as you step out the door. Clear skies, dry conditions, and another afternoon of 80s. Your biking forecast, warm again. We should be in the low to mid 80s again this afternoon, which means by about 12 o'clock, hitting upper 70s. Beautiful patio weather, both at lunch and at dinner tonight. We'll see Denver at about 85, upper 70s to even some, it looks like upper 60s in through the mountains, so some pretty calm conditions and nice and warm. Skies are again going to be clear, but there is rain and snow in our forecast this weekend. Our next cold front set to hit on Sunday, so some nice more fall-like changes into the first of next week.